let's support some Fortnite models. Go to the link in the description and join this Discord server. In this Discord server, go to V2 Download. Now, if you don't have this, go to Channels and Roles, Browse Channels, and then this select it here. If you're in V2 Download, download Fortnite Porting.exe. There we go. Before you download this program, make sure that you have Epic Games and Fortnite installed. Unlike me, fucking dumbass. So before we install the program, let's go to Epic Games, Library, locate Fortnite, and go to Options. And make sure you have high resolution textures checked on. And I'm not sure if this is necessary, but I think pre-download streamed assets is also good to have. All right, so after you downloaded the thingy, Go to Downloads and let's install Fortnite Porting. If you get this uh, message, just go to More Info and Run anyway. How nice of Fortnite Porting to just give you this install. So we're gonna just download that. It's uh, going to happen automatically. There we go. Should open automatically as well after you've clicked. Uh, after, you're, after you've opened it, install. Yes. Close. Go back to Fortnite Porting. Wait, where's Fortnite Porting? I guess go back here and then Fortnite Porting. Let's go and we press continue and that's basically it. Only little thing we have to do now is install the plugin for Blender. So let's press sync, nothing happens. So what we do then is to press this little plus and then locate where your Blender is located. Yeah, mine is in my Blender builds and then here and then there. And it's after you've after you've located your Blender, it's gonna say this, press continue, open Blender, go to edit, preferences, add-ons, Fortnite, porting as you can see uh, mine is already turned on but you should check anyway it's probably turned on for you as well though after you've done that save preferences close and now you can just go to assets and just select or search for any skin and just press export to blender and as you can see it just appears here wow look at them now if you don't want these bones to be in a weird direction like this it, like they're all pointing up that's not uh, nice to look at we can go back to fortnite porting go to export and press reorient bones as a little side note, there's also a Tasty Rig IK here. That's good if you wanna animate, for example, and you need a really fast rig. So as you can see, if we go here now, let's also, by the way, select the second styles. You can also have different styles. Yeah, pretty cool, right? Huh. And you go export, boom. As you can see, all the bones are correctly oriented and it's a little easier to read. Wow. If you go into shade mode as well, you can see all the shaders are applied. Pretty neat. If you want to import an emote, you have to make sure that you have your model selected, then uh, pick one and press, just press export. There we go, we have the emote. Now this uh, looks a little bit weird. I think this is because I have the larger model, like the Hulk is larger model, but uh, it will probably work on your regular sized Fortnite skins. Then you also have props or entire prefabs, vehicles, wildlife, items, you just name it and they pretty much have it here. All right, thank you for watching. Thanks for Half Heart for being awesome and see you next time.